Don't lose no sleep over these haters, man. The reason they got a problem with your life is because they don't have a life. You got a problem with me? You go right on ahead, homie. I sleep good at night because I've gotten rid of all things, people, and situations that were bringing drama, negativity, and dysfunction in my life. Fuck people. One thing you have to learn early in life, I didn't learn this till later on. I don't give a motherfuck. You can't care what anybody thinks about you. Find out who you are, whoever that may be. I don't give a fuck what you are. Find out who you are and own that motherfucker and tell people to go fuck themselves. Don't ever worry about anybody and what the fuck they think about you. You do that, I guarantee you, your life will be in shambles. You will become the biggest bitch of all time. So a lot of people can live with themselves. That's the first thing. A lot of people can live with themselves, look in the mirror and say, I'm okay with being afraid. I'm okay with going on this easy highway over here. The easy highway has all these fucking signs and shit, directions, how to get somewhere. And you have to first be uncomfortable with how you feel about yourself. With that voice that a lot of us like to run away from, we all have it. We all have that voice to say, hey man, you know, you're, you're kind of wimping out right now. You're kind of being a little punk right now. But a lot of us say, okay, that's okay. It's okay to tell these little white lies to ourselves. So we first have to face the real you. The real me is David Goggins. The real me is a guy looking at you right now saying, I don't want to fucking be on this show right now because I used to stutter as a kid. And I'm afraid of that. I'm afraid that here in a second, I'm going to start fucking stammering and stuttering. The whole world is going to know that I have all these issues. But that's when I see right now, okay, Goggins, you got to go on this fucking show. That's Goggins. Goggins is saying, okay, David Goggins, you're a punk. Life made you this way. We can't live like this. We can't live in fear. We can't live in judgment. We can't be afraid of what the fuck people right now are looking at me saying about me. We cannot be afraid of that. That's Goggins. Goggins saying, fuck all of you who don't like me, who don't want to. And that person then comes in. But you have to be David Goggins and say, man, I'm afraid of this. I'm fucked up here. Life made me this way here. I stutter. I, I have these issues with, with, with uh, reading and writing and and I'm, I'm, I'm fat and I'm insecure. You have to face that in that dark room. In that dark room is who you are. But in that dark room is where you have to create another human being that walks out of that dark room to face who you are. That's the only way you're gonna get over all those things. You have to create someone else. Not like you have two different personalities, it is you. But you have to find strength. And that visualization of almost me cracking out goggles, like almost like that Superman cape, like, like, like I'm coming out a different person, a person that doesn't give a fuck about anything, doesn't care about being judged, who knows I'm weak, who knows I'm afraid, who says whatever you think about me, take it, whatever, I'm here. That's God. I am great and I don't owe anybody an apology. I am phenomenal, and I don't owe anybody an apology. I am going to do great things, and I don't owe anybody an apology. I was created to do great things, and I will no longer ask others for their permission. With success in life comes more haters. Don't make them hurt your feelings. Use them for fuel. Use them for energy. In times of need, put them on the fucking mental Rolodex in your mind. And when you don't want to do shit, Roll through your brain. Pull up that motherfucker that you need. That person who said you couldn't do something. Run fast enough, good enough, smart enough, whatever the fuck you may be. Use it for energy. Fuck people.